Easy. Hello everybody, Twitch Nitro here. And it comes to my attention that a lot of people seemingly keep asking, why can't we just, why can't we put, like, different types of slabs on top of each other? Well, it's, it's really, really easy, guys. You just put down a sticky piston, like so. Select the uh, type of slab you want. Throw down a lever. And then force the game to do it. See? I mean... It really is that simple. That, 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 there's no trick to it. I mean, it's just... It's just that easy. I don't, don't see why people haven't like figured this out yet. I don't know, maybe it's because... It's a fairly recent addition to the game. I, I, I don't know. I just, I just don't know. Yeah, so so quit complaining. Now you can uh you can do double uh, double slabs. All right. Well, video over. Bye. <laughs> uh, <laughs> okay. So uh yeah, I'm 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 just I'm just trolling you guys. This it's not. This isn't. It, it's obvious that this isn't actually a a, a sort of double half slab or a, a two different half slabs fused together. I am using trickery as always. Uh quick, make a comment uh, on how I did it already, uh, you know, in 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 the description <laughs> before I I do the the not so grand reveal. Um it's quite easy really if I just destroy this lever. That whole thing will disappear. That's being done by a set block command. If I remove this, I've got the the redstone. I've got two set block commands here and it's uh it's really easy. I'm just using falling sand. Uh, if I remove this, so we get a side on view, we can see sort of how it works here. Uh, the piston extends and that's falling sand. It's halfway between the block and then the other thing is on top. See? Uh, it's a technique that's been shown a couple of times and used in multiple things. I just thought I'd make a fun little video, you know. Don't, no need to take everything so seriously. <laughs> I'm probably going to get quite a few rage comments from this. Uh, it's sitting on block 36, which is the Minecraft piston extension. So if we just, uh, oh, I think if I, I don't think I can, how we go, do that, do that, there we go. Um, ah, here it is. Yeah, it, for some reason in this snapshot it's being displayed like, to the side of the block. It's actually sitting on top of here, but for some reason it's over here. So this is the piston extension block. When you break it, there's fancy particles. Uh, redstone, that's... There we go, I can replace it by using that. And it's got the, uh, the block there, you can see the outline. It's an invisible block. And when falling sand entities... Nope, that's not it. That's it. When falling sand entities are slightly through the block, uh, they don't land on the ground, so they stay as entities. So as you can see, I can pass right through it. And the fence here actually keeps it suspended halfway through a block. So that's how it uh, looks like a half slab when these are around it. Uh, these have to be around it. Uh, ha other half slabs have to be around it because you get... It, it's strange now because it used to be that you had to have only one on one side and it would sort of let light through and trick the game. But I think there's been some light engine changes, because now the entire section, each face, goes dark individually. <laughs> so I hope you enjoyed this uh, video, this short video. I um, I hope I didn't make too many people mad. Uh, hopefully some of you haven't seen it before, and, and, and this is new to you. Uh, yeah, so, for real now. <laughs> Until next time, bye.